yeah, it was a five set there. It was a big fight all the way to the end. And yeah, when I was 10 7 up in the last set, and then he came back 10 8, I started to get a bit emotional there because I could see that the goal was, you know, was there, the medal was there. But that one point, it's never over till it's over. And I just threw a side spin serve in. He popped it to the side and I angled it off, and that was the end of it. But yeah, amazing. My class one gave us a lot of technique and style and control, as well as attacking play. But yeah, mental side of that, that pressure there was. I've never experienced that before. That that was doesn't get bigger than that. The journey has been a lot of ups and downs, as you can imagine, with sport, uh, stress, worry, finance. You know, it's it's been a hard struggle, but uh, yeah, it's all been worth it when it got this around my neck. I've always said I my ultimate goal is to play in the Paralympic Games and to play in the London Games at home, and it's my first one, as you say. You know, it's, you can't get better than this. Well, it's been a new structure with British table tennis. That's that's for sure. Uh, the training is a lot more strict, it's a lot more you know, hard work and once a week we've got training camps once a month up in Sheffield and EIS and all this has paid off and, and it is definitely brilliant. Well, like you say, we've got two medals, we've got none in Beijing and we've still got the team end to go yet so hopefully it's a chance for another two to come so if we can get another two on top of the two we've got, fantastic for British table tennis.